What's going on guys, Big VP here. On this one today, not only did I win one pinball stream giveaway, I won two giveaways. Two different streamers, both streaming Stern's X-Men. Uncanny. Let's take a look at what I got. All right, you know the drill. If you're not following me on all the socials, what are you waiting for? Be sure to follow me at Vic underscore VP. There's a convenient link tree link down below in the description. You'll go there. You can check out my website. You can also see all the socials, Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, YouTube. I post a lot to Instagram, so the stories on Instagram, and also YouTube shorts. Unfortunately, YouTube shorts only gets one minute out of all my social stuff. Also, TikTok. Just... Be sure to follow everywhere. Also, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you think of these giveaway wins. Yeah, I never win giveaways. But when I do, I win back-to-back -back giveaways. <laughs> now, before I get to unboxing this, yes, I already unboxed it because I was very excited for this one. Let's take a look at a snippet of the actual stream. Giveaway number one, this was on a Tuesday uh, it was about two weeks ago from Twitch streamer The Dumb Pinball Show. Yeah, so we're gonna do a giveaway of Stern Pine Glasses again, or and uh, or yeah, we'll just do uh, Stern Pine Glasses again. So all you have to do is you have to be following and then uh, literally just say something in the chat right now. Uh, Type the word pint glass if you want No, no, no. Let's get something colder. Type your favorite X-Men name if uh, if you want to be in this drawing. Uh, I'll show everyone. Doing the uh, giveaway now. And the... Oh, okay. Is that, who, is that who it is? Yeah. It is going to Vic VP. V-I-C VP. Good job, Vic. Woo! Yeah. Great work. We'll send that out. Uh, if you could just, we'll message you right now to get your uh, information and we'll send those out. Uh, that's from Game Exchange, a nice donation from Game Exchange of Colorado. So thank you, JJ. Now, as you can see from his stream, he basically had to type something in the chat. I never understand how that works, uh, but he started out first by saying type anything in the chat and then he changed it to type your favorite X-Men. Uh, so I wrote Wolverine. And sure enough, he spanned the wheel and you could see that he's talking to his partner and he's like, is that the winner? And then he goes, Vic VP. So that was awesome. He did tell me to send him a whisper on Twitch. And uh, two weeks later, I got the prize. Now this one I'm actually very excited for because as he says in the stream, it is pint glasses. So I unboxed it. I was, like I said before, I was already excited uh, for this one specifically because of the pint glasses. But as you can see inside, I do have the pint glasses here, but he also threw in not only one, but two t-shirts. So this is pretty cool. He did ask me for my t-shirt size during the stream. And I believe it comes from Game Exchange. I'm actually going to wear one of these right now. This is pretty cool. Nice little uh, pool table slash Pac-Man pinball going on here. And then his second one. It's more of a brand shirt. There you go again, the Game Exchange of Colorado. And in the rear, I'm gonna wear this one probably. I kind of dig this one. Take home the fun with Game Exchange. Ask me about buying a pinball. If I could fix the strip. There you go, okay, cool, there you go. Ask me about buying a pinball. Uh, yeah, I probably would've wrote buying a pinball machine, but hey, again, shout out to Game Exchange Again, Twitch streamer, The Dumb Pinball Show, and Game Exchange of Colorado as they supply the giveaways. There you go, Game Exchange. I like this shirt. This is actually pretty cool. Again, that's my microphone right there. Solid stuff, I, I dig it, because it's, it's, it's gaming as not to mention with the lighting here, you could definitely see it. So very surprised to get to see two t-shirts. I thought I was gonna get one, but they sent over two. But the biggest thing is what's inside of this it would have been hilarious if I actually dropped it. They gave me like some random coasters. 19th hole. I don't really know what that is. Uh, oh, it's a recipe. Cool. I don't know if that's from Stern directly, but there you have it. Look at that. No, my luck. I'm going to drop it. We have two Stern pint glasses. 
I showed it to the wife and she's like, what is that? I said, yes, it is a stern glass if my camera could focus. There you go, it is a stern glass with a pinball in it. How awesome is that? That's, that's, that's a great win right there. Again, stern pinball double pint glasses. Now, I did see some reviews on this, and I also saw the price of these, too, and I was like, whoa, awesome. Um, apparently, you have to really be careful when you, like, wash the ball. Uh, they said to make sure you wash it good and also dry it good because some people have this, and apparently, balls get rusty. <laughs> so, just got to keep that in mind. Again, inside of here is, like, I don't know, two, two coasters and another, like, Ben shot. Cheers from Ben shot. I don't know what that is, but, yeah, awesome. Thank you for your support. Cool, that's probably the actual makers of the glass. That's actually cool. Benshot.com. Very cool, look at that. They even have one with like a golf ball in it. How interesting is that? And a bullet. That's, that's cool. Awesome. But yes, big shout out and big thank you to The Dumb Pinball Show. My first ever giveaway. <laughs> now again, keep in mind, The Dumb Pinball Show stream was Tuesday night. This again is two weeks ago. Tuesday night, he was one of the first people to ever stream X-Men Uncanny. Uh, I was great, I won a giveaway, I'm all excited, I sent the whisper, I'm all set. Next day, Wednesday, we got flipping Out Pinball with Joel and Jared. Uh, coincidentally, I commented on that giveaway and I won. Let's take a look at Joel's stream again over at Flippin' Out Pinball. After next game, okay, second giveaway. Random. But have people type in chat what they want to see from Stern next year. Okay. So, with that said, three, no two, squalito. not Squalito. Two, let's hope for the US. One, here America. we go. Vic VP, Vic, Vic VP, VP, which I know, Victor, Vic VP, he was a <laughs> JJP. I should not, the winner should not be people we know. Vic <laughs> VP, he was one of, yeah, oh wow, Vic, how you doing, man? <laughs> yeah, rigged, rigged, <laughs> Ryan, sorry guys. <laughs> text, text you've won one before, yeah, okay. Vic, we know Vic. So check out Vic VP, he does, he, he makes YouTube videos. Uh, check it out. Rigged again. I know, I know, I know, I know. Joel, you know, no, I do not know everybody. There's a lot of names here. There's 300 something people here. I do not I'm know I'm Joel, you do know a lot of people though. I love Joel's reaction. It's very funny. Uh, again, because everybody's always like, it's rigged, it's rigged. It's, 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 it's hilarious. But when he said my name, it's funny. He says my name and you could kind of see him kind of look down and he's like, oh crap. It went to like somebody that we know. So I was, I was laughing at that. Uh, again, I met Joel when I went to the Avatar JJP Media Day. I didn't make a video on Media Day because honestly, there was much better people such as Erica's Pinball Journey and even Manu. Manu made a couple of videos, so I didn't want to be like a broken record. My main thing that I got my views off of honestly is the topper gameplay footage of Avatar CE. I did have the opportunity and privilege of meeting many, many people in the pinball realm at Media Day, and one of them was Joel. It was very funny, I was actually at the entrance along with uh, Ken Cromwell, we were hanging out, and uh, I'm playing, you know, we're just at the front door and all of a sudden I see Joel enter, and uh, I try not to freak out or geek out, um, I try to keep it professional. Uh, I went up to Joel, I was like, hey Joel, I'm Vic, and then Joel looks at me, he goes, I know who you are Vic, nice to meet you, and I was like, oh, <laughs> Joel, Joel knows me, that's so cool, and then I, again, that whole day I refrained I, I really had to not fanboy out and take pictures with a bunch of people. Uh, I didn't want to seem like that. But it was just kind of satisfying to hear Joel say, like, I know you, Vic. I was like, oh, that's so awesome. And then got to see him play. Watching him, like, analyze Avatar, I was there just to play, and I was excited to play. Other people were like, I'm going to actually study this game and understand the shots and all that. So it was pretty cool. Again, shout out to Joel. Uh, awesome dude. And he's tall. That dude is tall. He's a, he's a tall guy. I was like, damn. You're tall. I had to look up. <laughs> now, again, it's just funny to see his reaction because he read Vic VP and then he goes on the whole thing about him on YouTube. So, again, that was hilarious. This one I was very excited for because I knew it was a banner. Again, big shout out and thank you not only to Joel and Jared, but also to Zach and Nicole over at Flip It Out Pinball. I just didn't know which X-Men banner I would be getting. Oh, it's upside down. Let's take a look. <laughs> this is awesome. It is the beautiful Wolverine. Yes, I 
I forever love War Wolverine. That is a great, great design. So again, there you go. That is Stern's Flipping Out giveaway. A big shout out and a big thank you over to Flipping Out Pinball, Joel, Jared. You guys are very entertaining. That's awesome. The banner is actually pretty cool. Uh, I was looking at it carefully. I thought it was the print, but it's actually the artwork. It's giving like that, that dot design. So you can kind of see there, like there's actual like dots printed. I thought it was the actual like vinyl that made that, that look, but it gives you that comic book look. So it's actually pretty funny talking about banners now. Uh, I still proudly will always have my Godfather banner from JJP. And again, speaking about that Media Day event, they also gave me an Avatar banner. So this is kind of cool. I have two Jersey Jacks. I'm going to try to break them all out. I'm actually going to compare real quick this banner versus a JJP banner. Again, this isn't a competition. Uh, these are giveaway wins. I am forever grateful with my giveaway wins. Uh, it's just kind of cool. It's very interesting to see how Stern's banner is you kind of see like you could see the white stitching and then you can also see the grommets here not bad decent sized but uh again not to make it sound like a negative i don't want to sound like that uh again we're just going to compare it real quick to a jjp because i think the jjp is a little bit wider along with a little bit taller i'm just gonna casually walk across there it's actually funny you guys to take a look now the game room has changed my battle station you can see now we got the three pinball machines here look at that let's see how can we I want to make sure you could see it. Look at that. So, again, the Godfather. That is, you know, it's a, it's, it's a, it's a big banner. And again, this is on my pinball streaming rig. Uh, if we just kind of, hopefully, you can kind of see the bottom of it. It's a little short, not awful. And then, as far as like width, yeah, it's like what? It's like four inches. It's not that, not that big of a deal. As far as the bottom though, it's a good foot off compared. So this is a foot, a foot shorter, but four inches skinnier. Again, all in all, awesome stuff. Look at that. Beautiful. Now it's like, where, where am I going to hang it? <laughs> now it's very funny. Again, as you can see, I'm moving more pinball machines down. And yes, I do have room for four more. Uh, I got to figure out where we're putting these banners, <laughs> but you can see there avatar. This one, I'm gonna have to proudly hold up because again, that was from Media Day. Comparing it to The Godfather, same. Awesome. The only big thing, like I said, when it comes to like stitching, at least the stitching on Godfather and on Avatar, you can kind of see the black trim, so you don't really see the stitching too much. Whereas X-Men, it's a white stitch. But again, I'm not here to complain. This is awesome. I love this. I now have to put up three banners. Godfather is like, I feel like I'm gonna put it where that TV is. I'm pointing right here. Then it's like next week, put Avatar. I have a lot of little crevices, but I'm excited. This X-Men one is, is beautiful. This is gorgeous. I, I like this, especially with Wolverine. Oh, I am a Wolverine fan. So this, again, big thank you. Flipping out pinball. What, what a giveaway wins, wins. <laughs> I'm just like awkwardly trying to end this video, but yes, big thank you again to the dumb pinball show for the double stern pint glasses. And again, big thank you to Joel, Jared, Zach, and Nicole over at Flippin' Out Pinball for the X-Men banner. Back-to-back -back giveaways. I will drink to that. Go, 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 go. <laughs>